Although we are gathered here for the same reason, we hail from different lands. Some were born and raised in the Alexandria of old, while others came to us from Tuliolal. It was from this union of diverse peoples that a new Alexandria was born. The only home that our younger generation knows. How did we overcome the barriers between us? What moved us to join hands in common purpose beneath crackling skies? You know the answer. We survived. We thrived. Because Queen Sphine brought us together. Inspired and encouraged by her boundless kindness, we strove to be better for ourselves as well as those around us. And in Her Majesty's absence, there is a sadness beyond words. Yet we must we will remember her. Remember all the good that she has done for us. So let us pray as the people of the Old Kingdom once did for the peaceful repose of the departed. And let us keep our beloved Queen forever in our hearts, that her memory might guide us unto the morrow. Would that I could find solace in my own world. Was Queen Sphine taken to the cloud? She must have been. To still remember her is strange, isn't it, darling? I miss her. She would always cheer me up when I was down. But even though I remember her, I'll never see her again. That doesn't make sense. It seems that's what it means to die, I'm afraid. But... But what will happen to us? Are we just going to be sad forever? What will happen indeed? 
everything that we have, we owe to Queen Sveen. How are we to go on without her? I still remember Her Majesty so clearly. If only I didn't, I might feel better about the future of our realm. Perhaps we should also consider moving to Tuliolo. The journey won't be easy, but it'd be better than staying here in uncertainty. In times like these, I take comfort in the beliefs of a Turali people called the Yorkui. To them, death isn't the end. So long as we're remembered, we never truly die. It could be the same for Queen Sveen, you know? If you keep her alive in your hearts, she'll always be with you. But we still won't be able to see her, right? I don't want to think about that. I wish I could just forget instead of having to feel like this. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to impose. Please, mourn your queen however you see fit. As expected, they struggle to come to terms with their loss. I hope they can find a way to move forward. It's not only grief that weighs on them, but worry for the future. Bereft of their queen, how will they proceed? True, but with that at least, we're not powerless to help. What is it, Guloja? I was wondering, is it better to remember or forget someone when they're dead? I remember my father, and every time I think of him, it hurts. It's the same with Queen Sveen. Knowing that she's gone makes me feel sad. But it's different with my mother. I never knew her, so I don't feel as bad. I want to remember my father, but maybe I'd be better off forgetting him. Kulolcha. Why don't we continue this somewhere else? <laughs> 